Hey, I'm Sharon. I'm an ACE certified personal trainer. I designed six exercises today to target your core. We're gonna do three mat exercises in a row for 30 seconds and then take a 30 second break. The second circuit is three more exercises standing for 30 seconds and we're gonna do those in a row. Remember to warm up before you exercise and cool down with stretches at the end. Enjoy your workout. Our first core exercise are hip thrusts. We're gonna lay on the mat, place your hands by your side, and you're gonna, we're gonna bring our knees up and press um, our legs towards the ceiling. We're gonna set the clock at 30 seconds. Let's begin. Use your core and your hips to press up to the ceiling. Try not to use momentum. Keep that core nice and strong. As you come back down, mirror your back to that mat. Again, use those hips and that core. Take it nice and slow. You don't go, have to go up as high as I am. We're gonna move on to our next exercise. These are scissor kicks. We're gonna stay right here on the mat. Again, lay down on the mat. Now this time we're gonna place our hands under the small of our back to protect it. I'm gonna bring my feet up. I'll demonstrate first what we're gonna do. We're gonna go out and cross. Let's place 30 seconds on that clock and let's begin. So crisscross, one foot in the front of the other, keeping that core nice and strong. And again, notice my pace, not too fast, not too slow. You can lower your legs if you'd like, whatever feels good for you, this is a little harder, or just keep them up. Keep crisscrossing. And remember to breathe while you're doing this exercise. We're gonna move on to our next exercise, which are pivot twists. I'm gonna demonstrate this one also first. Your hands are towards your glutes. You're gonna bring your knees up to your chest and stand tall. My chest is out, my shoulders back. I'm gonna to pivot to one side and extend my legs and come back up, up and go to the other side. If you don't wanna extend your legs all the way, just keep them bent slightly. Let's put 30 seconds on that clock and begin. Push out, reach, come all the way up. Push out, all the way up. Keep pivoting. You are working your obliques, which are the side of your core. They're equally important to strengthen. Pushing out and in. Follow your legs with your head. Remember, sit up tall. Keep your chest out and your shoulders back. And breathe. We're gonna take a 30 second break before we set our, start our next circuit. standing core exercises are going to be chops to our knees. Let me demonstrate one for you. Arms are going to be up. You're going to come down, chop between your um, legs on that knee, and then come down on the other side. Let's put 30 seconds on the clock and begin. As you come down, make sure that you round your back like you were doing a crunch on a mat. Have your legs about hip width apart. It will help with stability. Make sure you're breathing. Keep your head down when you come down to chop between your knees. This is a great core exercise. We're gonna move on to a weighted oblique. I'm gonna use a weight, you do not have to use a weight to do this exercise. The weight goes in one hand, your other arm comes up by your head. We are going to lean the opposite way of the weight. Let's put 30 seconds on that clock and begin. Have a slight bend in your knee as you do this exercise and make sure that you keep your shoulders back and your chest out. My head stays in alignment with my spine. We are working those obliques again. 
We're going to switch after 15 seconds. All right, let's go to the other side. Bring that hand up. Again, keep a little bend in your knees and just a little movement to that side. Work those obliques. Great. All right, our next exercise, we are going to do um, side kicks or side lunges and we're gonna work that core. Put 30 seconds on that clock and let's begin. Come down and up, down and up. We could also reach overhead. And again, if you can't stand still, then you can always put your foot down or just lunge slightly. We're gonna switch after 15. So go to the other side and up, other side and up. Use that foot to push off of, stand tall. You're gonna feel that in your core and your legs. Great job. I'm going to finish my workout with two more sets. If you like my video, give me a thumbs up below. Remember to visit my website and look for more videos to come.